The emu is the second largest living bird by height after its ratite relative, the ostrich. It is endemic to Australia, where it is the largest native bird and the only extant member of the genus Dromaeus. The emu's range covers most of mainland Australia, but the Tasmanian, Kangaroo Island, and King Island subspecies became extinct after the European settlement of Australia in 1788. Emus were first reported as having been seen by Europeans when explorers visited the western coast of Australia in 1696. Emus are soft feathered, brown, flightless birds with long necks and legs, and can reach up to 1.9 meters feet in height. Emus can travel great distances, and when necessary can sprint at 50 km per hour, 31 miles per hour. Emus form breeding pairs during the summer months of December and January and may remain together for about five months. During this time, they stay in an area a few kilometers in diameter and it is believed they find and defend territory within this area. Both males and females put on weight during the breeding season, with the female becoming slightly heavier at between 45 and 58 kg. Mating usually takes place between April and June, the exact timing is determined by the climate as the birds nest during the coolest part of the year. Emus are farmed primarily for their meat, leather, feathers and oil, and 95% of the carcass can be used. Emu meat is a low-fat product, less than 1.5% fat, and is comparable to other lean meats. In first year emu lays 8 to 10 eggs, in second year it lays 12 to 15 eggs. The egg production increases 25 to 30 till sixth year. Emu eggs are emerald green in color and weigh about 600 to 800 grams. The incubation period is about 52 days, eggs are collected and are stored in a cooler temperature of 60 degrees Fahrenheit maximum up to one week. Later, eggs are set in the incubator machine and designed to hold them with a dry bulb temperature of about 97 degrees Fahrenheit and wet bulb temperature of about 80 degrees Fahrenheit up to the 48th day with a regular turning mechanism every one hour. Eggs are shifted to the hatcher on the 49th day until the 52nd day they are kept in it. Emu chicks hatch out naturally on the 52nd day.
Sometimes assisted hatching is also carried out manually. Emu chicks weigh about 370 to 450 grams. Emu chicks have body stripes and long legs. For the first 48 to 72 hours, emu chicks are restricted to the hatcher for the absorption of the egg yolk and proper drying. Then, they are shifted to the brooding shed which is prepared well, in advance with thorough cleaning by disinfectants. Emu chicks are fed with special feed called feed starter mesh for the first eight weeks. After which, they are fed with bird grower mesh till 42 weeks. A regular veterinary checkup is carried out with vaccination against diseases such as bird influenza. When any bird falls ill, then the others isolate it. After three months, they lose their stripes and their feathers turn brownish black. At the age of 5 months, they are shifted to an open paddock, and after 12 months, they are shifted with the adults. Adult emu is up to 1.9 meters feet in height, it has got a small head with a long naked neck. They weigh about 45 to 60 kilograms, their lifespan is 30 to 35 years, their entire body is covered with long feathers except the neck. They have strong legs which are covered with scales and have three toes, phenotypically emus look similar in both sexes. Identification is done by marking different colors on legs. Emus forage in a diurnal pattern and eat a variety of native and introduced plant species. The diet depends on seasonal availability with such plants as acacia, casuarina and grasses being favored. They also eat insects and other arthropods, including grasshoppers and crickets, beetles cockroaches, ladybirds, bogong and cotton bowl moth larvae, ants, spiders and millipedes. They forage for a variety of plants and insects, but have been known to go for weeks without eating. They drink infrequently, but take in copious amounts of water when the opportunity arises. To set up the farm, it requires moderate piece of fenced land with shed, and with sufficient amount of water. 
it can tolerate temperatures ranging from 15 to 55 degrees Celsius. It is fed twice daily either with emu feed available in market or with available vegetables like carrots, potatoes, tomatoes etc. Emu also feeds upon gravel in order to improve digestion as it helps in grinding food in stomach. Economic importance of emu farming. Emus are used for making medicines and cosmetics. Emu oil is utilized for treatment of various conditions namely arthritis, skin treatment, burn injuries, hair loss etc. Unfertilized eggs which are emerald green are cleaned and used in crafting antique, with different carvings on the shell. Emu feathers are used for decorative purpose and for making ornaments. Their feathers are soft and are being used in preparation of brushes specifically in cleaning hardware and circuits of electronic goods. Emu skin is of high quality and is used for preparation of leather products. Emu meat is 98% fat free, rich in iron and vitamin C and thus it is good for consumption compared to others poultry meat. Emu farming in India is in developing stage, it started in India in 1998 in Andhra Pradesh. Presently emu farming is being carried out in large scale in states of Andhra Pradesh, Tamil Nadu, Maharashtra, Karnataka and Kerala. Emu farming is one of the fastest growing industry in India with 2 lakh emu population. Emu farming is one of the most profitable and fast-growing industry. Government provides 100% loan and subsidy of 25% to farmers of general category and 33.33% to that of scheduled castes and scheduled tribes category. Emu products are gaining popularity all over the world.
At present, emu farming in India is in developing stage and presenting a promising and long-lasting future.